Hi guys, it's Betty. I just have a quick share video, a few cards I made, and then um, a Joann's haul from this past uh, weekend. Um, I am so in love with the stamp set from Hampton Arts. It's the little birthday cling mount set, and I know that they were on clearance at Michael's long ago, so I don't know if they're still available at all, but um, I use this cupcake for cards so often that it's crazy. So had a couple birthdays recently, and so I made a couple cards for friends um, with the little cupcake stamp. I um, stamped it twice, and once I um, used some Versamark pigment ink and peony and clear embossing powder on both the cupcake liner and the little initial. And then I just used some stickles on the um, frosting itself. And I think it turns out pretty cute. Um, perfect polka dots, embossing folder, and a little um, ribbon on some pink cardstock. And then I just embossed the sentiment inside as well. And then the second card, um, same thing. I just used, you know, embossed the liner and paper pieced a little bit. And then um, the background, I used a texture fades from Stampin' Up! Um, Harley Quinn. And then some Certainly Celery paper, Certainly Celery ribbon. Um, and again, just a little sentiment inside. So just super cute little cards and hopefully my friends will enjoy those. And then I wanted to share um, a few things I got at um, Joann's this weekend. I recently signed up for their email and so I received a 20% off of coupon for all items including sale and they had their Spellbinders 40% off so I picked up a few of those to use my additional 20% coupon. So I got the classic scalloped oval small, classic oval small, and then the labels number one. So looking forward to using those. I picked up the Tattered Time Matte Stack, um, which I do not have this paper yet, and I'm looking forward to using it for cards and a few little mini books. Lots of goodness in this stack. Wow. And um, I wanted the lemon flower paper mat stack, but all I could find was the cardstock. And um, I love this paper, and so I I thought, why not just get the matching cardstock mat stack? So um, a few like, ten shimmer envelopes from DCWV um, for ninety seven cents. They're in clearance. I thought they might be good for mini books. I like how they open their top opening, so um, I the color wasn't too bad. They had a pink too that I wasn't too interested in, but I do like that blue. So, And then I picked up the large paper stack of the Tattered Times. So I uh, am looking forward to using that as well. So just great paper in there. Um, I had looked at this one too a few times and put it back and I decided to go with it this time. And then I picked up another lemon flower paper stack. Um, I have a number of things in mind for this paper, so I'm looking forward to using it. So, and then I also picked up more, since this was on sale and I had the extra 20% off, I picked up more of the 12 inch chipboard. I think I had talked in another video about this where you get the 10 craft medium weight chipboard and then it looks like the whiteboard and blackboard 10 each are kind of a lighter weight. You can kind of see it's 10 of each but obviously the craft is a lot thicker there. So um, and I, I have tried cutting it and I like the quality. I, I have some graphics chipboard that's a little bit uh, thicker weight, but I, I think I like this too, a little bit thinner, um, with different uses for both. So this is um, by Colorbach. Anyway, that's all I have for now. Just a quick little share, and thanks for watching. Bye!